Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. You have already known the topic from the video title. And if you are new on this channel, please do subscribe and press the bell icon for latest video update. Previously, I have discussed about the 180 degree conduction mode of a three phase inverter circuit. And today I will discuss about the 120 degree conduction mode for this inverter circuit. If you didn't watch the 180 degree conduction mode video, then at first watch this video. The link is provided on the description box. Because 180 degree conduction mode and 120 degree conduction mode are very similar to each other. So here also we are using the same inverter circuit and we generate the pulses as similar as previous that is the pulse generator block you can see on the screen and the main difference between 120 degree and 180 degree conduction mode is there was three transistor remain on at any instant of time but here only two transistor remain on at any instant of time and here also the switches will on as the same manner as previous that is switch S1 will on at first after 60 degree delay switch S2 will on and then after 60 degree delay switch S3 will on and this is going on simultaneously and from the waveform you can easily recognize this and you can see on the below that there is a phase voltage waveform of this 120 degree conduction mode you need to understand how the phase voltages are generated. If you consider a star connected resistive load, then for the first interval that is 0 to 60 degree, switch S1 and S6 is on. And you already know that if upper switch of a leg is on, then the output is positive. And if the lower switch of a leg is on, then the output is negative. So for S1 switch is on, the output is Vs by 2 which represent the phase A voltage and for the S6 switch is on, the output is minus Vs by 2 which represents the phase B voltage and because none of the switches are on from the third leg, phase C voltage is 0. If you want to know that how Vs by 2 came, then simply draw the equivalent circuit at your own. You can find it out easily. Similarly, if you do the same analysis for the other intervals, you will get the same phase voltage waveforms. So let me do it on the MATLAB. Previously you can see for the 180 degree conduction mode, the pulse width we gave 50% because the total cycle is 360 degree and the turn on time for a switch is 180 degree. But now the turn on time for a switch is 120 degree so then you have to give the percentage of period is 33.33% or 100 by 3 
So let's check the output. Yes, the phase voltage is achieved. Then look for the line voltage waveforms. Yes, the line voltage waveform is also perfect. So this is the 120 degree conduction mode of a 3 phase inverter circuit. So if you like this video, then hit the like button and for latest video update, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.